Hey guys, it's Pythagoras here. I'm gonna do my first video, so this is always gonna be like the awkwardest video you have on YouTube. Already doing unnecessary hand motions that you can't even see. So I'm trying to make this one of those channels, you know, like Scrubby, Memeless, you know, Cyrus, you know, channels like that. So yeah, let's get right into the video. So today we be watching something called My Strange Addiction, and it's on TLC, which is a pretty weird. <coughs> channel which I'm pretty sure is an actual channel on TV I'm not sure you're not sure please comment if you know okay but anyway so apparently this guy is addicted to putting cast on his body which I think is pretty disrespectful and let's not drag this out any more than it has to so yeah my name is Kevin I'm 27 years old I live in a suburb of Chicago I don't have any broken bones, but I'm addicted to putting orthopedic casts on my body. Okay. What? Like, what even is the point of this? It's kind of weird. And how can you get addicted to something like that? Like, one day you're just walking across the street, somebody just limping in a cast, you're like, hey, look at that over there. That looks kind of comfortable. Uh, I think I'm gonna get myself a cast two years later uh, what are you what is what are you coming in this group for now uh, I'm addicted to putting cast on my body like uh, this therapy doctor whatever the hell you call them is like why the hell are you putting cast on your body this I can't even fix Casting is putting a cast on myself. I'm perfectly fine, perfectly healthy. I like the feeling of the cast around me. Okay. What type of person do you have to be to like having cast put onto your body? And also, casting? Is that even what casting means? I thought that meant when you're like heating up metal, you know, and like you pour it into a cast, and that's casting, right? And like, first of all, what type of person puts their own cast on? Doctor's like, wait, and how does he even take them off either? Does he have like his own little cast saw? And where does he even get these from? Seriously, like, is the doctor like, hey, I sent you addicted to it, just keep on getting it. It's like, I don't understand how somebody could be addicted putting cast on their bodies. This doctor, this guy's doctor might even be a little bit more, you know, than him. I just did that motion and none of you seen me. That's pretty smart. I've done like two full arm casts, two full leg casts. I've done two full leg casts and an arm cast. I've put on so many different casts, it's ridiculous. What I love about casting is it just feels so amazing and so snug and so comfortable. It gives me like this high that I just can't really get any other way. Uh, I'm pretty sure this is unnatural, and I'm just gonna start making comments so we can get farther in this video, okay? My earliest memory of casting was definitely in early grade school. At about six or seven years old, I used to steal all of my parents' toilet paper, and I used to wrap up my legs in toilet paper to mimic- What? What? So this kid has been addicted to this since he was seven years old. Oh my gosh, this person really needs some mental help, medical help. I don't remember anymore. Like I said, you can find the weirdest shit on the learning channel. Wait, I didn't say that. Well, let's just say I said that at the start of the video. Make a cast. When I was 12 years old, I broke my arm rollerblading and I got my first cast. I got a lot of attention with a cast on. And uh, it's just kind of been an ongoing process ever since then to just learn as much as I can about it. I am just seeing everybody like, oh, that, that gawk look, you know, it's just amazing. Man, I've been waiting for this all week. When it comes to ordering the materials, even that I kind of get like jumpy about because it's like, all right, you, you know, you're going to order them and you're actually going to use them. I don't remember what I ordered. I can't wait to build a huge cast out of this stuff. Where the hell does he even get this from? 
like literally the dark web, the black market. I wonder even if there is a black market in America. Wait, how does a black market even work? Wait, where did the black market even get its name? Wait. I just backpedaled so much that I literally just tripped in my own thoughts right there. This is like happy birthday, Thanksgiving, Christmas, everything in one. I just, I definitely want to get a cast on like right away. Oh my gosh. Look at that price tag. Uh, this guy, he ain't that much in the head. Whatever that means. You never know when there's just gonna. Oh my gosh! He brings his supplies everywhere, everywhere. Like just imagine, like seeing somebody walk across the street, like lugging around a huge box just full of medical supplies, and they're like, "What, bro? Are you about to die?" Nah, I'm just addicted to putting cast on. And then you slowly back away, back away. And then you hide in your room because you have some sort of weird type of PTSD, like TLC, T. Be a need to put on a cast. Probably not the best way to do it in the car. It's not the best circumstances, but. When you're casting on the fly, you just gotta take what you got. It just screams attention. I can't wait to go into the bar and show off this new cast. It's gonna be so cool to have everybody looking at me. I uh, uh, there's just so many dumb things about that statement. I can't even pick one to make fun of. I sometimes do pretend like I'm injured, and that all goes with the story and how I try to draw people in. There's actually, I was on the subway, and this guy tried to steal my wallet out of my back pocket, oh, and I no just quick right hook, boom. Ew. Girls are constantly coming up. Oh my gosh, is this guy trying to flirt by pretending like he got injured? Like, oh my gosh. Like... To me, and, and like, oh, what did you do? Oh, you poor thing. It's a fake cast. I mean, it's a real cast, but my arm's not broken. And you're wearing a fake cast just for the fun of it? Yeah. Really? <laughs> That face you make when you realize the guy you're about to ask for a phone number is actually a psychopath. My reaction when he told me that he casted himself, I was thinking, that's kind of weird. And I just wasn't interested. And then a lot of times I have people Like I said, that face you make. Yeah. Sign it. You want to sign my cast? <laughs> I know I know it sounds really strange, but I'm just trying to get a bunch of people to sign my case. And so he's playing this like, oh look at my poor wounded green candy striped freaking cast. And it's it's it kinda makes me a little nauseous, actually. Like I said, it's kind of offensive to do something like that, you know. Cause those people actually wear cast. Wait a second. That's not a permanent fix. Whatever. Most of my friends know about my addiction to casting. Obviously, at first, when I first told them about it, they were like, this is just weird. What bothers me about it is I have to get him into the car because he can't turn, he can't move, he can't even go to the bathroom by himself. Casting is definitely... When, you're, when your addiction is making it so you can't use the bathroom, you really need to go into therapy, not just get on some student, sort of stupid TV show. Like, get these people therapy, come on. It, like affected my relationships. I broke up with my fiance. She couldn't stand the casting anymore. Uh, she just thought it was too weird. This cast addiction is really wrecking. He broke up with his wife because of this addiction? Like, most of the time when people get broke up because of addictions, it's a lot worse stuff than this. But this weird of a thing for somebody to be broke up with, like, jeez, how did you get, even get addicted to this first place? I know I asked that before, but seriously. Can havoc over my relationships. 
I mean, there's been a lot of people who have asked me to stop, you know, stop casting. And, um, you know, frankly, I... Okay, guys, so I think I've had about enough of this for one day, so hope you guys have a great day. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hope you guys enjoyed the background gameplay, and see you all next time. I don't have the outro, so peace. Wait, that's weird. I mean, whatever you want to say. Just make it up in your mind. Put it in the comment section.